please, a nice hand for Jade Catapreta. I love 16 and Pregnant, too. You guys know that show? The title pretty much explains the, the premise of the show, but I love it because the little montage in the beginning where the girl's like, hi, my name's Ashley. I'm a size two. I love tennis. My life's like pretty much perfect. <laughs> but that's all about to change because I'm pregnant. <laughs> and they're like, this is my husband, George. And we're like, you mean that 14-year-old boy with no pubes? What are you talking about? I just gave birth to that thing. That's your... I'm going to have my own version of the show. It's just going to be a bunch of, like, Jewy old women around a pool. It's going to be called 60 and Pregnant. I'm a size 12. I love life. I love capas. What are you going to do? I thought I pissed myself the other day, but I didn't. Because I'm pregnant. Little Benjamin Button baby comes out. Feed that thing. It looks hungry. Well, you know, you're a big fan of reality shows. Yeah. As, you, as are you. Not really. Well, you love uh, Celebrity Apprentice. I like Celebrity yeah. Apprentice. Although I can't tell the difference between that and uh, Celebrity Rehab. They both seem the sound. I can't wait for this season. But seriously, it, do you have to have a screwed up life to have your own reality show? I don't know. I guess it's an attention thing. People love attention, you know? Not me. <laughs> <laughs> but how bad, how embarrassing would it be if your own reality show got canceled? Oh, that's I mean, that would be like scary. saying your life is not interesting at all. <laughs> no, no, like, you know, or your problems aren't interesting. I don't know. I, I watch them all, though. I'm not going to lie. I mean, all of it from hoarders to animal hoarders to people <laughs> hoarders. Um, but, uh, but you don't want babies or you do want babies? Oh, yeah. I'm, I'm very excited to have all right, babies. Take it easy. Take it okay. easy. <laughs> How many would you want? I think I want, I want two to three babies. So you'd like to have a big family? Well, yeah, I like. Well, I have a small family, and my parents were always like, they were never like the have all your friends over type of family. So I'd love to be like, you know, that parent that get, lets everyone come over. And you want to, you want to be the stuff. house where. Uh, well, that's yeah. what my my friend has. Uh, all, all their kids over because they know at least we know where they are and they're not right. getting in trouble. You know, sure they're shooting heroin, but yeah, they're but here they're in at our the house. Ho- they're at your neighbor's yeah. house. They're not yeah. going to go out driving after that. Who wants to go driving on heroin, right? Come on. And do you think you'd be a good mother? Yeah, I think I'd be a great mom. Mm-hmm. 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 <laughs> and what if your baby was a, a dwarf? Ooh. That's a hard one. <laughs> Would you put him up for adoption? Yes. No, uh, no, 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 no. You can't tell when they're babies. Uh, <laughs> at, what age, at what age can you tell? I think you start to tell. I think it's like a two- to three-year-old Thing. Would you ever abort a child? No. Well, not again. <laughs> oh, oh, I'm boy. I'm kidding. I haven't had an abortion yet. <laughs> I think the big question with abortions is, when does life actually begin? Now, what worries me is a lot of people say life begins at 40. <laughs> so, so, yeah, so we're clear. We're you've got to draw the line somewhere. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> nice to have for Jake yeah, Caprano, ladies and gentlemen. Yeah, everyone. 